Well, today I found out that one of my sculptures fell apart. That's what happens when they sit for too long. They eventually give out. This one, uh, the armature broke on me. I don't know if I can repair it. It's the Viking that I did years, ago, a couple years ago or a year ago. It's probably not recoverable. Yeah, well, that's what happens sometimes. Move on, that's all I can do. Time to play with some clay. I've decided to go back to the original idea for this uh, sculpture of uh, the Christ and uh, I'm going to use the uh, walking staff across the shoulders and uh, I'm going to stick with the original inspiration. Uh, right now I'm going to try to skin out the uh, stick that I got from outside. I've got to use a pair of gloves to hold the stick because it's got little thorns in it. And I'm going to use a potato peeler to try to skim the uh, skin off of it. I don't know if that'll work, but somebody suggested I do that, so I'm going to do that. Uh, like when I peel a potato, it clogs up. Hmm, interesting. Well, whoever it was that suggested this to me, it's a good idea. I spent the last week taking some time off. I had to uh, build my courage up to do this uh, project because, like anything new, it takes a little bit of courage to do it because you're doing something for the first time and it ain't easy. Seems to be working with my handy dandy potato peeler. As far as the Viking statue, I'll figure out something. I ain't gonna worry about it right now. That works really nice. It does clog up fast though. I think I can take my gloves off now. The sticky part is gone. Yeah. Oops, hit the camera. It's hard to do this and put it on camera. I don't have somebody holding the camera for me. <laughs> oh. This 
this uh, peeler works in both directions. How about that? As seen on TV. <laughs> There's a lot of little tiny hairs. Maybe what I'll do is see if I can burn those off. Uh, let's see. Yeah, that think I think that's gonna work. Puts off a weird smell. <laughs> But it gets rid of those uh, little hairs. A lot better than sandpaper did. All right, that prepares that nicely. I'll hit it with a flame again tomorrow. I can still see some little strings, but uh, I think that does a pretty good job. All right, I'll be back on this tomorrow. And uh, see you guys then. Give me a thumbs up and share my video. And then check out my instructional DVDs, uh, the link down below this video. All right, see you next time.